Hey boys and girls, it's another great day for a writing lesson. So Monday, we started creating our um, heart map, our narrative heart map. You should have pictures, ideas, and illustrations. Then on Wednesday, we wrote all about me and you told me unique things about you. Then yesterday, Thursday, you told me about your family and you listed all kinds of unique stuff about your family. Today, you're gonna pick something else from your heart map do, 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 do. all about my pet we could pick you might could pick all about your best friend um so i actually don't have my best friend listed but i am going to write about her today so you could write about your best friend too and let's talk about how to do that so you've got your idea from your heart map remember we don't flip open to just any page we go one by one until we find the next page so I have all my great writing samples in here, and then I'm going to start at the very next page. I'm gonna create my four boxes, nice and even, okay? And then my title is going to be my, remember it is capital, best. And then what do I do when I run out of room? I go to the very next line, good job my best friend and our title does not have to have a period so remember in each box you're going to tell me a sentence about whatever your topic is you can also add um, pictures for your details if you are having trouble writing sentences you could do pictures but you guys are great writers i have seen it this week so i want to see best sentences so my best friend I'm gonna tell you that she, notice I started at the top line and I'm working my way across, starting with a capital letter. She lives in Charlotte. So my best friend lives in Charlotte. Am I done boys and girls? Goodness, no, I've forgotten that silly old period. Don't forget your period and your spaces in between your letters. So that's one fact about my best friend. Now I could tell you another one down here or I could go ahead and stop and add an illustration for detail. I could draw her house and maybe where she lives, but I'm gonna go ahead and do my sentence next. Another sentence about my best friend is that she has brown hair and I can't forget my period then I could draw an illustration of my best friend showing you that she has brown hair and I would use realistic colors by coloring her hair brown my last box I'm going to tell you another a fact about my best friend and I'm going to say that she is married with a period at the end. Then I could draw maybe a picture of her at her wedding that was so beautiful or any other details that I wanted to show you. Okay, so you're gonna put your topic here. Three sentences, you can draw pictures for detail if you choose to do so. Remember, all of our sentences need to start with capital letters and with periods and then you can add illustrations for more details. You guys have done a fabulous job writing this week. Please do your best job writing today. This is the last one for the week. So don't forget all the things that we have talked about and we will keep writing next week. Thank you.